Once again, Lee saw opportunity, but he desperately needed better coordination amongst his subordinates. He again chatted with Jackson, who seemed like his old self, but his passage through White Oak Swamp was again painfully slow. True, Federal artillery fire was a concern, but Jackson showed little energy to find another crossing or ford. And then, incredibly, around 3 p.m., during an artillery duel, Stonewall Jackson found a tree and went to sleep. He rose one hour later, found time to write his wife a letter stating that $50 was appropriate to give to the church, but paid little attention to bringing his force to bear in the fighting at hand. Later at supper, just after dark, Jackson again fell asleep, this time with a piece of unchewed biscuit between his teeth. <laughs> 